Hi guys, uh, welcome to another short uh, video clip of uh, MrLopezClasses.com uh, Today we are going to talk about uh, cavitation What is the meaning of cavitation? And uh, why the cavitation is not good in your boat, in your car, in your motorcycle? Cavitation is basically the formation of uh, vapor bubbles in a fluid With the temperature the bubbles increase the bubbles explode and eroded the metal, the surface of the metal. Yes, cavitation is the erosion of any metal surface because uh, vapor bubbles explode over the surface and eroded the metal. Why the creation of bubbles in the fluid? The bubbles are created because the fluid pass from laminar flow into turbulent flow. When the flow of the fluid become turbulent, a lot of bubbles are created. And uh, when the temperature and pressure of the fluid increase, the bubbles expand. And suddenly, the bubbles explode and eroded the metal. This is cavitation. Where you have a cavitation uh, in your engine, in uh, your car, your boat, okay, in the, in the impeller, of uh, the circulating pump, the coolant pump, in that area uh, is, is very common that the blades are eroded or the housing of the pump is eroded because uh, the formation of uh, bubbles. Why? Because uh, the, the hoses and the clamps are loose, uh, you have a leak of uh, coolant, and uh, if you have a leak of coolant, for sure, you have intrusion of air in the fluid. And if you have air in the fluid, the fluid become farming and uh, the bubbles increase because the temperature increase, the bubbles expand and the bubbles explode. Exactly the same with the cylinder liner. You remember in our course of uh, this one, if the liner is free, the liner is moving up and down, up and down when the piston is moving. And uh, remember that the liners uh, in, in a wet system uh, is uh, circulated with the coolant. Uh, if the coolant around the liner, the liner is moving at high speed, create bubbles. And when the temperature of the coolant increased, the, the bubbles expand, the bubbles explode and eroded the metal. This is another great example. Uh, other is on the place. <coughs> you remember the propellers? In, if this area have a bend, cracks, uh, when the propeller is, is spinning at high speed, those cracks, create the formation of bubbles in this area, in this area. And uh, if the speed of the propeller increase, the pressure on the bubbles increase, the bubbles expand and eroded the, the, the surface of the metal. Uh, and you have situation like this. Uh, it's pretty similar in the course of corrosion, we are going to analyze uh, electrolytic corrosion. And uh, the phenomenon is pretty similar. The situation is pretty similar that when you have a cavitation. It's very common cavitation on the propeller blades because the, the propellers are bended, are cracked, and uh, when, the, when the fluid pass over there, creates create that, that amount of bubbles over there, and uh, the bubbles expand and explode if you pass the limit of speed. This is why you need to keep uh, clear about how much is the maximum speed allowed in your boat. And don't try to increase the RPMs over the limit because you you create a lot of uh, cavitation and you destroy the blades of the propeller. This is cavitation.